G'day, welcome to another Curriculum Burst. Here's a curious counting question for high schoolers. It goes as follows. A set of tiles numbered 1 through 100 is modified repeatedly by the following operation. Remove all the tiles with a perfect square and renumber the remaining tiles consecutively by starting with 1. Okay. How many times must the operation be performed to reduce the number of tiles to a set of 1? Okay, I know I've read that out loud, and I probably read it in a way like I understood it. I didn't really take it in. I've got to go through this again slowly. A set of tiles are numbered 1 through 100. That's fine. So we've got the number of tiles 1, 2, 3, 4, da, 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 99, 100. Set of tiles numbered like that. What are we doing? We repeatedly do an operation, and the operation is remove all the tiles with a perfect square number. So step one is cut out the tiles with a perfect square number. 1, 4, 9... Uh, 16, 25, up to 100. So get rid of all those guys, cut them out, and then renumber the remaining tiles consecutive, consecutively by starting with 1. So the first step would be cut out these tiles. That's 1 squared, 2 squared, 3 squared, up to 10 squared. There's 10 of these tiles. So there are 90 tiles left, which get renumbered 1, 2, 3, up to 89, 90. Step 1. Do this repeatedly. Keep going and see how many times we go to all the way to get to just a set of one tile. Okay, so apparently I keep doing this operation and I'll end up with one tile in the end, and the question is, how many times? Yep, how many times to do this step? I've done it once, well, let's do it a second time. The second time, I'm going to cut the tiles 1, 4, 9, 16, up to what square number do I get up to? Um, 81. 81. Uh, that means I'm cutting, what, 9 tiles? So I've got 90 tiles to begin with, now I'm going to have 81 tiles. 1, 2, 3, up to 81. Step 2 leaves me with 81 tiles. Do you know, I guess this is a strategy that's just sort of unfolded before my eyes. Just persevere. Perseverance is key. Strategy number 7. I just keep doing this. In fact, if I kept doing it, one more step, 81 tiles, which means I cut 1, 4, 9, 16, oh, up to 81. 81's it there. So I cut another 9 tiles, leaves me with 1, 2, 3, uh, 9 less, so it's up to 72. Yep, this strategy will do something. I could just persevere, keep going, and see how many times I cut things out, how many moves I make. All right, I'm going to keep doing that. In fact, I invite you to do it too. Why don't you keep removing tiles, and then when you get the count of how many times you've done that step, that's the answer to the problem. Compare the answer with the answers in the essay that goes with the video. I wonder if we came up with the same answer in the end. By the way, I think there's a very curious algebra, su algebra surprise in this question. So really do look at that essay. There's a nice little twist to go with it cool stuff actually. All right, thanks very much. Thanks for watching. For more curriculum inspirations material, go to our website. Lots of great stuff there.